Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm going to make a bulingi. So that's steam pudding, but it's not going to be steam. Okay, so I'm going to make the pudding and I'm going to show you guys the ingredients. It's been a while since I made a pudding. The last time I made a pudding, uh, that was for my mother-in-law because she always uh, enjoyed. And that's, uh, she's passed away now for some time. And it's not because of my pudding, guys, no. It's just that uh, my dear mum-in-law passed away. It's just that time, you know? I don't know, my poor mum-in-law misses so much, we all do. But um, the carnation milk, and that's evaporated milk. These are all the ingredients for the pudding, guys. Look at that. Anyway, evaporated milk. Uh, oil, you're gonna need a, like a cup of oil. And I got mixed spice. Uh, I'm gonna add a little ginger, guys. I know, you, you guys are gonna think, ah, oh, nah, ginger. And then I got cinnamon, nutmeg, bicarb soda. I know, they give it in this big jar when we hardly use it, you know? Anyway, got the plain flour there. And gonna need sugar. I use raw sugar, guys. Uh, this sugar is to burn to make the burnt sauce for the pudding. And then that's the free eggs. You're gonna need a um, a cake tin of that size. Bam! And the stuff to stir it. And my bowl. So, guys, that's all that you need. And this is the custard for later. Cause I was gonna make a custard, but uh, my daughter said, "Mom, you're gonna make the pudding, and you're gonna need just a anyway." My daughter said, "Don't make the custard." Yeah, okay. I snitched. <laughs> okay, Shh. yeah, I love it. Yeah, and uh, this pudding is um, it's a request from Mary Tuliao. So Mary, this is for you because you requested it. Okay. Yeah, so you get this cup of um, sugar and then you want to brown it, you know, to make the sauce. If you see my other video before when I made um, the fa'a usi, the fa'a, fa'a, fa'a usi, yeah. Yeah, Mary and Pani <laughs> told me I was saying that wrong, like, it's fa'a usi. Mm, yeah. mm, champion ala king if I look at la fa aussi. Hey. Yeah, well, anyway guys, getting back to this. Yeah, well, um yeah, I made the you know, the sauce like that, like but I put in um coconut cream, but this one um it's evaporated milk for the pudding. So I just wanted to everything to dissolve there. Hello, are you Doing a job, it's a key door. You know how the Asians put it up on high? Mm, I think I better do the same. Get this thing going. Because you gotta cool this down, guys. Gotta cool it down, you know, so you can tip it on the flour and it's not like burning hot. Okay, so just get this going and then I'll get back. Okay, guys, don't want this long video. Don't want this video to be long, guys, so I'll get back, okay? And then this will be all brown, ready for this to be poured over. Wait, Laura. Mm. Guys, see how it's like <laughs> near burning? <laughs> okay, this is the time, right, to pour the evaporated milk. But I would move it, okay? I would move it. Yeah, it's got that nice burn look to it. Anyway, we do it slowly. Uh, 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 uh. Yep, yeah, nah, ooh, it's like a lava. Yeah, lava, lava, boom, and my lava. Yeah, hey, oi, oi, behave yourself. Behave. Behave. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> well, look at that, guys. Look. Ooh, burning. Nah. Time to stir it. Because you want that thing to dissolve as fast as possible and get cooled down. Anyway, I'll turn this off because. I don't need it no more. Let's stir, let me out there. 
See? That got burnt fast. <laughs> See, this is why I love gas. See, guys, this is why I come and um, cook at my daughter's house, because her gas is faster. Oh, if I cooked at my house, I'll tell you what. If you had to cook this, right, you can go, have a sleep, wake up, have a shower, uh, build a house, yes, live in it for five years, and then it'll just be starting to get brown. That's how slow my oven is, guys. Say struggle is real, struggle is real. So guys, I've got about a half a cup of uh, cold water here. And then you just add a bit in here. Okay. Look at that. Oof. Ah! Oops! Oops! Mm. Oh, sorry, Sharon. <laughs> I spilled it. Yeah, a white. Easily done. Oh! Okay. But I really need it, eh? Anyway. So that's it, guys. Hi. Say you say you are nice. Okay. Dry ingredients, right? We we're gonna put in um three cups of flour, plain flour. And I don't normally measure but for this one. Putting if you get it wrong, you get it wrong, guys. So that's three cups. This three cup will be right for this cake tin, okay guys? So that's that. And then you put in one cup of sugar. I've seen people put in two, I think, no. One, I don't like it too sweet, you know, that's why I say one cup. Okay. Now for all this stuff, I think I'll take the lid off because imagine having to shake everything out and put it in a teaspoon. It'll be scattering everywhere. <laughs> so the nutmeg. Hey, <laughs> something's falling in there. So, so nutmeg. One teaspoon of nutmeg. One of cinnamon. I'll sort the caps out later. Um, yeah. And I'll put in ginger, guys. I know. He's probably thinking, ginger? Yeah, I know. It's just got this, um, yeah, one teaspoon of ginger and the nutmeg done and the mixed spice mixed spice one two yeah huh? bad yeah so that's done so i put in two all spice well mixed spice it says mixed spice but it's all spice and one of each one cinnamon, one nutmeg, one ginger, and two allspice. There you go. Okay. And the bicarb, guys, bicarb is two teaspoons. Okay. One, two. Then you mix it all up real good. You can smell it. Mm. You know all the spices? Yep. Okay. Got my pinches back here. How's it going, sweetheart? I don't know. Is it meant to be on? Oh. Hey guys. Before I came here, alright. I stopped by the shop and we got us a deep fried one. Found it up at the shop up the road. You know who's making them? 
Indian, PG and Indian. Why? So while we're waiting for the um, saucy thing to cool down, I'm having me a kick for Mmm, lucky me! Mmm, <coughs> quite tasty. Oh, yummy, fine. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Mmm, <laughs> My daughters they're working right so at least when they come home their mama bought them some food yeah so I bought us some too but I bought just lamb you know I can go home and make my own rice so just look how, look how lovely mm, I bet it's nice so one's chicken one's lamb and they're supper sweet okay guys and I'm leaving the other kikibua for them they would love that. I know my daughter Hope would love it. She loves Kikapua House. Anyway guys, I just wanted to show you guys my extra treats that I got. Oh, I love that shop down there. They're so lucky. Just down the road. Just on the end of the street. Why can't I be that lucky? Well, the sugar, um, the burnt sugar is ready now guys. So, I'll just um, get it and pour it into here. It's all cooled down, so that all goes into there. Then you give it a good stir. Right, come and have a look. See? Man, you can really smell the nutmeg and all the spices. several shells in it. Oh, you don't want to do that. <laughs> Whisk. I know everyone does this differently, you know. So you want to give this one whole cup one whole cup of oil so i'll use this when i beat the egg in it doesn't matter you know so that's like one whole cup i know guys you're thinking oh what on earth so you mix it in real good guys don't worry i know you're thinking oh ah there oil all that oil but trust me it all comes together <laughs> it will now this is the time for this whisk to come in just this stick mm -hmm. not doing anything to hang up now mix it real good hi fi yeah nice
So that's all mixed, guys. Look, I'm gonna have a look. Why? Yeah, little man, a yearly mix. Okay. Now I've got to oil my um my tin. So you get a spray and you oil it real good. So you know when it's time to tip out your, your pudding, it's not like hanging off for dear life, you know? It will just fall out. I think I better not go over there. It will pop over. Anyway, guys, so. Oh, my, oh, my, maka, maka, my. Look. Does that look good? Yeah. That only could be good if you see the end result. Anyway, just for now, you wanna bang. Bang. You wanna put it in there for like 150 to 160 to 40, 45 minutes. That's how you want to bake it for. That's how long you want to bake it for. But to be on the safe side, you just get your skinny, like butter knife or whatever, stick it in there. If it comes out clean, it pops your auntie. And if it comes out, it's still got stuff stuck on it. Um, then you figure out how much you want 40, 45 minutes. No, it is 40, 45 minutes, guys, for that amount of stuff. And you know what? This, this here, I've got some left diapers. So, this is what I'm gonna do. Guys, I had some left, right? Ooh, you know what? And then I thought I'll, I'll make some uh, little muffin tins here. I, I gave a bit too much loving to the other one. So I'm able just to make free here, okay? Mm-hmm. Oh no, this one's got a bit too much loving. Gosh, can you guys stop loving each other? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so when you guys got some leftover uh, pudding mix, just put it in here, have a little mini ones, you know, mini. Guys, that's all to it. Have a bite. <laughs> you know you can add um, like raisin sultanas into it if you want. And if you want to be extra extra, add chocolate chip. It's up to you. My mum in law, she used to love it with raisins. And I always do it only for her. My kids used to hate it, but what would they know about flavour? <laughs> Have another bite, guys. I appreciate you guys all the time, all the comments, all the lovely, lovely comments that you guys leave me. God bless you all. Uh, it, it makes my channel so like meaningful, you know? <laughs> like I'm actually doing something right for once. Nah, I did do, do something right for once. That was having my children. Anyway, <laughs> and looking after my mama bear. Anyway, guys, you guys will take care. It's been a pleasure having you guys along, watching me cook. And I hope you guys get this um, recipe going and let me know. Uh, join me on my Instagram and leave me a comment. Leave him, tag me on a picture of the result that, um, that you made. It's going to work. So if 
you follow it how I, exactly how I do it. You know how I've done the condensed milk and I poured it in? Well, you have to fill it, that condensed milk up with a full can of cold water and then you pour it into that sugar that I burnt. Add it after when, when the sugar's burnt. So one whole condensed milk and one whole can of, um, yeah, can of water. So I had that little extras and I'm baking it now. I think in five more minutes and then those little muffins will be cooked. And that's the ones that I leave for my daughter, <laughs> my daughters. So when they come home, there's four there. Yeah, they can mm, help themselves. Ah, uh, yeah. Bye, guys. Come on, we have fast food.